Here we're factorising a basic expression, 7AD minus 3ABD plus 9CDE. So our first job is to figure out what the common factors are amongst these three. So if we start with the numbers, we've got 7 minus 3 and plus 9. So you'll notice there's no number other than 1 that divides evenly into all three. So next we'll just go to the letters. We've got AD, ABD and CDE. So we can see from that that the common factor there is D. So the only common factor we have amongst all three is D. So we take that outside the brackets and divide each term by D. So that will give us D multiplied by 7AD divided by D. The D's cancel. So you're left with 7A over 1, which is 7A. 3ABD, again the D's cancel. So you're left with minus 3AB over 1, which is minus 3AB. And again here, the D's cancel. So you're left with plus 9CE over 1, which is plus 9CE. And that's our expression factorised. If you ever wanted to check your answer, you just multiply back in the D by 7A minus 3AB plus 9CE. So you just multiply that back in and you should end up with what you started with. On to our next example. This is a little trick here because we have indices involved in this particular one. So we have 14 alpha cubed minus 7 alpha squared beta. So just a word about the alpha cubed. Alpha cubed is equal to alpha multiplied by alpha multiplied by alpha. So to shorten that, they call it alpha cubed. Same with alpha squared. That's equal to alpha multiplied by alpha. So next we move on to factorizing this expression. So again, we start with the numbers. 14 and minus 7 and check if there's a common factor between those two. So we can see the number 7 7 divides into both 14 and minus 7 evenly so 7 will be a common factor. Next we take a look at the letters we've alpha cubed and we've alpha squared beta. So you can see alpha is common to both. Alpha squared will divide into alpha cubed and alpha squared will also divide into alpha squared evenly. So alpha squared is the other common factor. So what we've done is we've taken 7 alpha squared outside the brackets, so we divide each term by 7 alpha squared. So 14 alpha cubed divided by 7 alpha squared. 14 divided by 7 is 2. Alpha cubed divided by alpha squared is alpha to the power 1, or just alpha. 7 divided by 7 is 1. Alpha squared divided by alpha squared is 1. And we're just left with beta. So it's 1 by 1 by beta, which is just beta. And that's our expression factorised.